Hello everyone, Mark Wing here with VecTech. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to test the precharge in your accumulator. You'll want to do that anytime you believe you've lost the precharge in your accumulator or it's been reduced. We're going to do that with a flow control valve, a gauge, and a hydraulic pressure source. So let's hook it up. The first thing we're going to do is make sure our flow control valve is closed. And then we're going to energize our hydraulic power supply. And we want to charge the accumulator to a pressure at least 1,000 PSI over what you expect the precharge to be. Next, we're going to dump the pressure from the hydraulic power source. And you notice that the uh, flow control valve is holding, and that's because we have a check valve that allowed it to go in. And it's going to check it on the way out. So let's initiate our drop by opening the flow control valve slightly. And we want to initiate a steady drop. If it slows too much, you may have to open it just a little more. So we're going to let it drop. When the pressure that is inside the accumulator, the nitrogen precharge, that, when that pressure is reached, you'll see it drops immediately. So that shows that the precharge in this accumulator was 1,500 PSI. Here's the list of parts to build your own accumulator tester. To get a printable copy, click the link below. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up. And to be notified of future videos, subscribe to our channel and click the bell. Thank you.